How's it going guys? This is Lucian Sword playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always and uh, today we're going to dedicate this video entirely to all Blaster Legends. I think there's 10 Blaster Legends in the game, I could be wrong, but we're just going to start from... You know what? Normally I start from the top and go down, but let's reverse it today. Let's start with the bottom and go up. So the newest Blaster Legend that we have is actually Isaiah. Reason for me doing uh, all Blaster Legends is I'm just uh, kind of doing a video series on all the different legends, weapons, and all that stuff. And um, I've done a few different weapons, but I have not done Blaster Legends. So I figured why not? If you hear some weird sounds in the background, that's my Roomba. Like slamming into the door that is <laughs> right next to my room. All right, we're going against uh, No Wi-Fi Found today. All right, so now we have our first blaster. Oh man, I should have stayed on the wall. He probably wouldn't have hit me. No Wi-Fi found is actually one of my friends. Yeah, baby. Got him. <laughs> he almost got me on that gimp, though. Yeah. Isaiah, I'm not the best with, but... Like, like that, you saw, I don't really know what I'm doing with his uh, SIGs, so I just kind of throw them out when I think I should be using them, but really I don't have much of an idea. Yeah, got him with that. If I could beat No Wi-Fi Found, that would be awesome <laughs> because I'm not the best Isaiah player. Yeah, baby. Finally, I hit with an Isaiah Sig. GG, dude. GG. I think that was like the first Sig I hit the entire game. GG. Well played, dude. Well played, as always. All right, so that was pretty sweet. At least we started off the video with a win, even though I was a little sloppy there. So the next Blaster Legend that is the second newest, I guess, would be... Uh, let's see. Did I skip anything? I want to make really sure I don't skip any, because every now and then I do that. <laughs> kind of notorious for that. So we have Nyx. Uh, Nyx is a fan favorite. I get this requested a lot in my live streams. Um, by the way, if you want to uh, fight me, the best chance to do that is pretty much during my live streams, which I do almost every day. I don't always live stream Burhala. Sometimes I do other games. Uh, I had a really fun Risk of Rain 2 live stream yesterday, which was Easter, and I hope you guys all had a nice Easter. Um, but yeah, Nyx is often requested. And, um, I don't, I don't know if I'm, like, that great with her. Like, I want to think that Nyx is a really good legend because, like, she just looks awesome. She's got awesome weapons. Um, her signatures are pretty awesome. But for some reason, I feel like she Three, two, just one. isn't quite S tier. She's probably in the upper half of legends, but exactly where she falls. Oh, my God. I accidentally threw my weapon away. Okay. 
This is blasters. Oh my god, what a throw. She had a really nice dodge there. Not so much that time. She had to use her dodge to uh, get back on the stage. She's really, uh, think trying to bait the weapon, but I usually don't go for weapons right away for that very reason. Nice down air, though that saved me. She went from one side of the stage to the other. That was pretty funny. By the way, guys, if you enjoy the video, please go ahead and drop a like. It really helps. Wow, GG dude. I actually had a decent scythe uh, combo there. Well played dude, well played. Alright, so, wow. I did pretty good with Nyx that game. I feel pretty good, got the three stock. Um, normally I don't get three stocks with Nyx, so <laughs> that's pretty cool. Um, it feels like I missed a Blasters Legend, but I, I didn't. Let's see. I, I, it just seems like... It's just because at the beginning of the game, there's lots of Blaster Legends, but towards the end they didn't make them very often, so... Uh, the next one is Cross. Um, I've already done Hellboy content quite a bit, so I think I'm going to do Infernal Cross. Cross. Cross is a legend that I'm trying to level up to get to level 25, just because I want to get the black colors with him and, and every legend. I actually want to get black colors with every legend, so just, just a little personal goal. No reason, really, other than I just think it'd be cool to have. <laughs> and cool to be able to say I have black with every legend, but you know Hey going against no wife. I found again, dude last time I played him which was just like 10 minutes ago was a really close match so Three, two, And and one, it usually four. is he's a really good player very similar skill to me. I think which is fun Yeah. Oh, I should have stayed on the edge. See, he's smart and he, he ground pounds like a foot off the edge, which is really what you should be doing. Because like if you if you go a foot off the edge like that, you're more likely to spook the opponent and uh, get them to uh, go off the edge.
Oh man, I didn't have a jump or anything, dude. Like, I thought my guy had jumps because he hit the light, like, colors on him, but... I guess not. What an axe player. Dude, this is how you play axe. You gotta be you gotta be a bully. And see how he was camping that weapon? Normally I don't go for the weapon camp like that, but the one time I do, he gets me with that down sig, you know? That's why I normally don't go for it. That recovery though. <laughs> Axe is so good, man. GG, dude. GG. Well played, dude. Like I said, no Wi Fi found. Really good player. Unfortunately, I did have the one suicide. Otherwise, it would have been a better game. So, you know, my bad, but GG nonetheless. So, moving along, moving along. Cross, not, not one of my best players. You know, Cross, if he had a little bit different stats, like I would take one off of defense and give it to speed and one off of strength and give it to Dex. If he was like that, man, he would be such a better player in my opinion. All right, so moving along, moving along. Uh, we have Diana, one of, if not my favorite blaster legend. Now, I would have said she's my favorite. I don't, I don't, I'm not the type of guy that has favorites. Like everybody has favorite this, favorite that. I've never really understood favorites because I like so many things. Like, I don't have a favorite color. I like almost all colors are beautiful to me. And like, I don't have a favorite legend or favorite weapon. I like almost all legends and weapons because they're almost all good and fun. A better question would be, which ones do I not like? Because there's very few that I don't like. It's not how you start, it's how you finish. He had a good start on me, but then he didn't do like any damage after that. sure why I went right into that. And I kill myself again, dude. I gotta stop doing that. Like really. If you want to get to diamond or even plat, you got to stop killing yourself, man. Don't give them free KOs. I meant to do a neutral there. Keep trying to sidelight me, man. See where it gets you. Somebody commented I need to do more X pivots, so I'm gonna try to do that. I know how to do it, but I rarely do it for some reason. Like, I probably could have done it right there. And I went right into that. Yeah. 
And that. That should be game. GG dude, GG. Diana's really hard to beat. Also, yellow man bad. <laughs> All right, so Diana, she's awesome as always, obviously. Uh, moving along, moving along, we have Barraza. I'm gonna do sawed off Barraza. It's kind of my signature Barraza look. Rocking my new uh, black colors for Barraza that I unlocked uh, somewhat recently. I think it was probably like a month or two ago, but you know. One of my more recent black colors. Barraza I actually like a lot because Axe and Blasters, dude. Both two very fun weapons and he's the only legend that has the both. A lot of people don't really play Barraza, but he has a lot of potential if played properly. Alright, going against Radar. Playing a base Koji. I like this map. A lot of people say they don't like this map. I like it. It's kind of fun. You get a lot of really goofy things that go on in this map. If you can get them bouncing off the ceiling a bunch of times, it's pretty funny sometimes. Oh man, I really thought I hit him with that third one, but... I almost zero to death in there, I think. All right, let's try the axe out. Obviously, we're doing fine with the blasters. GG, dude. Two wins. Man, I only took 87 damage? Dang. GG, GG. Alright, that was Barraza. <laughs> um, and moving along to Lucian. This is my favorite Lucian skin, Dark of Night Lucian, but let's try something different. Let's do Bullet Diver. You don't see this one too often. The Lucian. Bullet Diver with the Lucky Clover looks really, really rad. Like, such an interesting color scheme. And by the way, guys, Lucian and Lucian Sword, like, nothing related there. I didn't name my channel after Lucian, the Brahalla legend. I made my channel way before Brahalla was even a thing. Not only that, but it's not even spelled the same. What? How did he know I was gonna do it that? Queen Nye, dude. I like that Queen Nye pick, no Wi Fi. How often do you see Queen Nye? Maybe you guys see her often, but I definitely don't. Oh, 
Oh! Oh, I didn't get him, dude. I thought I got him there. Dang. <laughs> no, dude. Oh my gosh, he got me with that neutral sig. That's that's like oh, so disheartening. <laughs> Smacked him on the head. All right. Come on, baby. We got to finish strong. He's waiting for me to attack almost every time. So I'm going to wait for him to attack. And I'm not doing it very well. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that hit. Go. Oh my gosh, she got me. Dang, such a close battle, dude. GG, GG, as always. <laughs> such a good battle. Well played, man. Well played. All right, uh, we're moving into the final phase of the video. We only have a few legends left for blasters. So we have Ada here. I'm gonna go ahead and use an Ada skin you don't see too often. How about, uh, how about Stormlord Ada? Ada. I love this one because of the uh, spear. The spear looks awesome, the lightning bolt. They should have given uh, Thor the lightning spear, man. This would have been cool. A small rubber duck. I do love playing Fate. I kind of miss playing Fate. I got her to level 25, got the black colors, and I haven't really played her anymore because after level 25, there's no incentive to play. There's really no rewards. Therefore, no point. And I want to get all legends to black, so. Playing a legend that already has black is kind of a waste of time. For me. Yeah, buddy. Oh, buddy, I almost got you off the roof again. Nice one, nice one. Oh, man, Fate is fun. I would put Fate at S tier, to be honest. I think she's a really fun and good legend. Her signatures are brutal. She's got a Scythe and Orb, two of the best weapons out there.
Oh man, I love how that hits from behind. Dude is hard to hit, but... Oh, GG. I thought for sure he would dodge under like some people do. He was actually waiting for me to do that. And he went ahead and punished instantly, just like I did to him right there. I gotta stop uh, dodging in the wrong directions, man. Oh man, I should not have done that. And I knew he was gonna get me with that. GG, dude, GG. What a great game. Man, we're getting some really close games in this uh, video. That's that's good. That's what, you know, that's what Brawlhall is all about. You get those close games, get your heart pump in, man. Win or lose, they're fun. They're intense, you know what I mean? Of course you want to win, but, you know, can't win all the time. All right, going with Poseidon Thatch. This is a legend you rarely really see in the uh, upper levels of, like, pro gameplay. Not really sure because he has really good weapons, he has really good signatures, he has a lot of speed. Maybe just because he doesn't have a lot of defense. That's like probably the reason people don't play him, but you don't need defense if you don't get hit, you know? Brahala has an insanely powerful dodge mechanic. You can dodge in any direction, you can dodge every couple seconds, like it, it's really good. So. All right, we're going against another fate. No clue what we are doing. Yeah, dude, I feel like that sometimes. So, different person though. Different person from the last match. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day, by the way, wherever you guys might be. Hope you're enjoying the video. All right, slingshot, let's go. With Thatch, I mean, look at these six. What other six throws out two cannonballs? Two cannonballs. Both with a different trajectory, making it hard to dodge. Thatch has low defense, like I said, so He's meant to be played, throwing out a lot of SIGs. He just is, you know? Most of his SIGs on Blasters are very defensive. This one is a defensive move. That one's just kind of a POP right at you. And then of course the Cannonballs, you know? Which are very defensive. Look at this, I can just camp the edge.
pop, pop. There's the three stock with Thatch. I think he was getting mad I was throwing out too many cannonballs, but hey, it's uh, not against the rules, you know what I mean? Oh, I have Black Thatch? I didn't even use him? Dang, oh well. All right, we only got a couple Blasters Legends left, guys. We got Vrax and Cassidy. Lord Vrax. I like this skin with Vrax. Just looks clean, different, intimidating slightly. Maybe not. Once you start hitting them with all these crazy uh, Vrax signatures, then it starts becoming a little intimidating, or if not intimidating, intimidating, at least annoying. Vrax is annoying to fight against. He'd be one of my top legends of annoyance to fight against. I should make a, a video, most annoying legends to fight against. All right, going against another Queen Nai, Joe the God. All right, you know, he likes to kick while I'm giving him a salute. That's, that's kind of rude, you know, Joe. But he's a god, so he can do what he wants. Oh, bye, Joe. I thought gods can't die. Okay. Bye-bye. I'll crush your soul. Maybe he didn't want to fight Lord Vrax. Maybe. You know, I mean, I would say Queen Nye is also annoying to fight against. Not as annoying as Lord Vrax. In fact, I'm surprised that only one person has rage quit there. Normally when I play, I get that all the time. People don't want to play against me. Not like, I would say maybe like 10% chance any match that right away they rage quit when they see me. Maybe it's Three, two, like that for everybody. One, I don't know. All right, going against Bestro. Let's go. Bistro? Bestro? Wrong move, Lucian. Wrong way, or he would have been toast. There we go. He's like uh, right on top of me, but having a hard time hitting me at the same time. <laughs> Missed him with the bomb. Close one. That time I did stay on the edge or on the wall. That should kill me? Wow, okay, well the recovery did.
it is, baby. GG, dude, GG. All right, guys, we've been playing for quite a long time. And now we are on our final Blasters Legend. Finally, if you made it this far, hallelujah, dude, and congrats. That's a long video. For the last one, I'm not even sure who I want to do. I th I'm thinking Calavera. Calavera Cassidy. Also, thank you for watching this song. If you made it this long, then you're awesome. Three, two, one, brawl! Hattori is not the best matchup versus uh, Cassidy. If you made it this long in the video, show me by typing meow in the comments. Meow, like a cat. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Meow for Meowhala. Which is the mod that you can get if you want the uh, kitty cat gadgets. That's a lot of damage. Cassidy has really fast attacks as well because of her dex. I haven't even been using her blasters. Oh, nice weapon throw. Alright boys, this is it. Final stocks, final match. Got her. GG dude, GG, well played. And thank you guys for watching this video. I really hope you appreciate it. I mean, I appreciate it. I really hope you enjoyed. Um, if you want to let me know which legend or which legend... Uh, which weapons you would like to see featured in future videos, uh, go ahead and let me know. I think I've done all Qatar Legends and all Bow Legends, and now I've done all Blaster Legends. So yeah. Um, anyways, guys, this is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, guys.